Um, hi guys, my name is Bella. I am so like totally overwhelmed to be here right now. And I would just like to say that like as a feminist, um, first of all, that like my name is Bella because my mom is a feminist and she named me for Bella Abzug who is like an like amazing feminist from like history in the 70s and stuff. And she did amazing, yeah, like amazing historical work. And like, I just feel that like I am in like history right now. And like, that's amazing to me because like, as like, a person who is straight but not narrow and like totally gets the whole like hierarchy problem. Like I am always telling Sarah Jones that like, cause like I met her because I was taking a feminism and philosophy seminar and we were discussing like, like people of color and like feminism and like, like queer identities and like, it was amazing conversation because like, first of all, I, I had already taken a pluralism workshop. So like, yeah. So I was like totally like primed to like receive. And like, w I came away with like so much like clarity and yeah, and like, I recognize that like my generation is like working with different information. Like I was telling Sarah Jones that like for example, I also consider myself to be like a person of color in a certain respect. That like uh, that color is like a pinkish beige color and I have to I have to like embrace the reality of my like place on the spectrum and see that like like there are differences like and I recognize my white skin privilege like totally and I just want to be an ally and that's why like I relate so much to you guys like bringing allies together and just like being one group of like forward thinking people it's like amazing to me and it's so like transformational and i guess like the one thing i would say is that like when i was a baby in the 90s my mom used to go do these like gaia women's retreat drum circle things in rhinebeck and <laughs> They, I, yeah, you guys probably totally also used to go to those. And like, because they have them for men too. And like, I just feel like that's where the seeds were planted in me. And I am so grateful today, like even just the fact of like, like this shirt that I'm wearing that says eroticize equality. Like I totally want all of you guys to be wearing this shirt right now. And like, I think that's because feminism has like evolved and it, feminism is human rights. Like I can't call myself a feminist unless I recognize the rights of all of my LGBT like fellow people. And like, that's really important to me. Um, and I think that's evolved. Cause like my mom's feminism, I think that like, even just the way she sees things is just a little different. Like, it's great, but like, she'll be like, why do you have to wear that shirt? Cause to her, like, feminism looks like Eileen Fisher, like, <laughs> like a, like a caftan. And like, I feel that like, progressives look like this. Like they look like whatever they want. And like hot. Because <laughs> you guys are totally hot. So like I, and I know that you totally get that I'm saying that in a way that is not objectifying you at all. <laughs>